All right, well, we are here today at Silver Moon Antiques, and we are in Lewisburg, Pennsylvania. We are here with Michael. We are here with Michael, who has recently started his own YouTube channel, The Cult of Vintage. And we're about to head in and see what we can find that we can buy and flip for a profit. So here we go. Go ahead, you can do my intro for me, go. Oh, so here we are inside, you guys. Cases. <laughs> <laughs> Look at these down here. These are really neat. We've got some uh, candlestick holders down here. Pair of rare chicken claw candle holders. Those opaline glass. Those are pretty, pretty cool. I don't think I've ever seen those before. Look at those claws. See a pair of Holt Howard salt and pepper shakers there. You say rooster Holt Howard. Ooh, look at that back there. Got the kitty on the creamer. Sounds like I'm looking, but this is where Jocelyn's looking. I thought you were looking at the glass, <laughs> no. and then I realized that and you I'm were like, looking at that. Look at this. That's why we shop well together. Yeah, because I'm all about like, what? Are you looking at that glass? I'm like, look at this garbage down here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what beautiful glass have you spotted, Michael? I don't see. I mean, these are pretty standard fare. Now there is a big. Michael's filming over there. Let's go look over here at this beautiful Royal Hager piece that I noticed out of the corner of my eye. We've got $20 on it. It's the mauve agate. It's got a repair. Just our luck. This uh, glaze is called the mauve agate glaze. It's absolutely stunning. I don't think I've ever seen that piece before, but it's a shame that it's broken because it is really nice. I've got some rice pattern there. $12. Trinket box with fish. Where, judging by those numbers, I would say that it was probably Japan. This is Queensware because it's got that glaze on it. Which would clean Queensware and nails. Say a nice paper weight. Twelve dollars and twenty percent off. It's pretty nice. I like that one. Twenty percent off over twenty dollars, so it's actually not twenty percent off. It's only twelve. But I feel like I can make twenty-five to thirty dollars on that, so that's doubling my money. And I'm always about doubling my money, so I'll take that. Not sterling bracelet right there. Sterling beaded bracelet. It looks like it could be Zuni. The one there on the end. Looks to be Zuni. I kind of like the looks of that. And then you've got all this Egyptian revival looking stuff. This one's from Siam. At least it's made to look like it's from Siam. Oh, that music is going to be the death of us. Oh my gosh, look at all of those little animals. There's a bunch of little figurines in there. Oh, glass figurines. Little weed whimsies. I don't know, I'm kind of digging that Zuni piece, but for $40, I think that's a little bit too high for us. All right, well, we've got some McCoy pottery up here. I'm kind of digging that piece in the back. I like the lines of it, but they've got $20 on it. I'm not really sure about that. Um, let's see down here. I'm kind 
kind of breezing through here because the music is a little bit loud. I don't want to spend too much time. We've got all of the Hummel figurines. Hummels are hard right now. I'm not seeing a very high resale value for those. So unfortunately, I'm going to pass on those. Um, that looks like it could be Hager. We've got a Hager planter back here. That was kind of like a baby shower piece with the stork. And, um, oh, we've got turtles down here. What kind of turtles do we have? Carved turtle, a couple turtles in there. A little carnival over here. All right, well, I'm gonna turn you guys off until I find something. All right, well, Michael is filming over there. We're gonna film right here. This booth is 50% off of everything. I've spotted this vase right here and I have no idea what the price is on it, but it is calling my name because look at the Moriagi on that. Oh my goodness. Now there is a little bit of cracking. You can see here, the discoloration in the cracks tells me that it's older cracking. What is the price going to be? Do we want to take bets on what the price is going to be? $85, but 50% off, and I am going to say yes to that because it is just absolutely, wait, is it firm? No, it's not firm. <laughs> That's amazing. Look at the birds on that. I'm just going to cradle this while we search the rest of the booth for anything else that strikes our fancy because um, I feel like we might. Oh, my voice is echoing as I talk into this. Look over here. We've got a copper dog here. We've got another copper dog for 15, but 50%, everything is 50% off. Let's grab the copper dogs. They kind of look like collies. Actually, this one looks more like a German Shepherd. That one looks like a collie. All right, let's go put this in our cart. Get in here and get something quick. You know how we're always saying that we love a sale? <laughs> I know it's even better than having a sale. It's having a friend who will tell you, did you not see that there was a 50% off you sale? Missed, you missed the sign. I missed the sign. And then I was like, well, that might change my mind. As I'm in here grabbing everything. <laughs> I'm like, did you see this? Did you buy walk it. right by it? Buy it. <laughs> everything 50% off? That, yeah. Get in here. <laughs> this is as is, but the only reason it's as is is because of this little itty bitty flea bite right there. Which is really not a deal breaker for me, and I feel like it wouldn't be a deal breaker for many people. It's not like a massive chip or a massive crack. That's a beautiful piece. It's half off. Four dollars and fifty cents. There we go. What? Twenty percent off lamps and lighting. Well, it's certainly not lamps and lighting, but what? I know lamps and lighting though. <laughs> oh, oh, and cash and check only. Yeah. Reading. Paying, paying with my card, so. Look at that emerald green. <laughs> it is a stippled ray, which is not like the most exciting pattern, but the emerald green is not super common. I mean, you're more likely to find it in amethyst or marigold. So that's exciting. Ooh, you got that, got that back there, that Burmese. Do we have? I was really digging this. They've got it Fostoria. Is that a, is that a unicorn out there? <laughs> They've got some nice stuff. Wow, what is this? Yikes, 95 Fenton Seasons a Fabril Vase. is not something I've seen before. Wow. 
I've never seen a friend in season's face. Interesting. Hmm. Michael checking out the cake plates. I mean, if you're gonna serve cake. You might as well do it on that thing. I love cake. What did you say? <laughs> I love the artwork in this booth. I've got some really nice glassware. See some stretch glass over here. What do we have? $25 on the stretch glass bowl. Feels really nice. What in the world is that <laughs> for $24? It's just very weird. Is it signed? I don't really see any signatures on it. It's very strange. I may have to investigate further with the camera turned off. All right, so it does look like there is some sticker residue on the bottom. So ultimately I am going to put this back because of that sticker residue. It's just making me nervous. Oh, look at that. More talky. It's a really pretty bowl. It's got $18 on it. See a discount here, unfortunately, because I might have otherwise pulled the trigger on that. We've got a set of RS Prussia six, six as is. Creamer, sugar, leaf white. I'm not sure. Oh, six dollars as is. Mm. That is a beautiful sugar bowl. Um. I think that this, instead of a creamer, since a creamer wouldn't have had a lid, this may have been a syrup. Um, a lot of the times the syrup would have a lid and an underplate. Right, well, what do we have here? This is a floral base. <laughs> Two dollars. Two dollars for the floral base. It is hand painted Japan. What I like about this is the way that it's formed. I love those dimples in it. It's only $2. I could make a profit on this, but I am going to pass on it just because we have so much inventory right now that I really don't need it. But I know that if I was to purchase this, I could probably make a profit on it. I'm just, I'm being picky right now. I'm being picky. I will be the first to acknowledge that I am being a little bit picky. This is also a nice piece, USA pink vase. It's nice. Abingdon. It's an Abingdon vase. We sold an Abingdon piece not too long ago. Abingdon is it's $5. Abingdon doesn't really get the affection that a lot of the other contemporary potteries get. And I'm not really sure why. It has a very mid-century uh, style to it. And it is really nice. I love the color. It's, you know, that pink, that pink that mid-century collectors love. This is only $5. Again, this is, I mean, this, that's a good price for it. Pilgrim glass up here. Well, what do we have here? It is a Jim Shore Angel for 27 Every time I find these, there's always damage on them. She appears to have both of her wings. But she is $28, and I'm just not sure the resale value on her. Look, we've got some dragonware over here. Ah, oh, look, I win. Those are praying hands. Yes, yeah, Justin, that, one point. 
That means you get the point. I get the point. The game's I can't claim the same hand. Nope. The game's not over yet, though. You still have your opportunity. I'm sure there's more here. We've got Sally back here. She, what is she, 70? 40? 70. <laughs> 70 dollars, they wrote it up. Wow, she's really neat. Juliet loves Nightmare Before Christmas. Right now she has that life-size giraffe in her room though. And I feel like one life-size doll is enough. I could trade out the giraffe for the Sally doll, but I'm not really sure how she would react to that. <laughs> oh, it's like regular dolls aren't creepy enough. Here, Juliet, here's the life-size Sally doll. You're welcome. What do we have here? Purple bowl, $12. Wow, that's pretty heavy duty. It's a nice quality piece. I'm surprised it's not signed on the bottom. It's got those dimples on it though. And it's only $12. I'm not seeing any discounts on the booth, but only $12, I will take that. Oh, and this is Michael's. This is Michael's fairy light. And he will likely be selling that in his live sale over on his YouTube channel. So, if you're not subscribed to Michael, you should be because he's going to be selling this on his channel. Well, this booth is 30% off of everything. And this piece is the one that drew me to it. Right here. It was this basket. You know me in the glassware. $25. They've got it marked as Fenton. Is it signed Fenton on the bottom? See, I wouldn't peg that as Fenton, but I could be wrong. That's beautiful. And it's 30% off. Cash or check only. I don't have cash or check. I mean, I do have cash or check, but the amount of money that I spend, I don't carry that much cash. $25. That is a nice piece. You know what? I might grab that for 25 I could double my money on that. Do you see it? Do you know what it is? Way Forge Blue Dog. I mean, it looks like the Royal Hager Greyhound, but we're going to pull it out and check. This is like reminiscent of my out of the way best moment. <laughs> That was like one of my fondest moments of thrifting ever. Glad I wasn't in the way. No, you were lucky you weren't in the way. Mm -hmm. Gosh, I was so zoomed in. Um, yeah, out of my out of my way, Beth. And everyone's like, you just pushed that other reseller out of the way. I'm like, no, she worked there. I was like, Beth, don't stand between me and the Hager. No. Seven dollars a piece. I got those Hager dogs for. This one's twenty nine firm. Ooh, that's not bad. No, it's not bad. Pretty sure it's Hager. Alright, what do we have here? It looks like we've got some penguins. Penguins. <laughs> this guy's great though. He's got his glasses on. Alright, I don't see much else. We got <laughs> the Greyhound sitting, he's standing guard over the cart because I'm afraid to put him in the cart to crush everything else. Check out this car. This is amazing. Do not touch it. 18,000. That's amazing. Right, let's see what's down in here. But this is Hager down here. This lady. This is, yeah, it was Marlin. Right here. What else do we have back here? This is an interesting booth. It's got a nice eclectic mix of things. These are always the booths that seem to hold the treasures. What do we have over here? Wood carved robin. For $24 firm. It is signed on the bottom. James something. Powers, it looks like. James Powers, the Robin. 
$24 firm. I don't know, I do like the robin. Now, one of the things I look for when I'm looking at these birds is their feet. And I know that sounds silly, but a lot of the times the cheaper ones just have pegs. They have like one single peg as a foot. <laughs> um, and the ones that they put more time and energy into actually have feet and a wire little talons. So um, I think that for $24, we'll take a shot at this. Why not? And I think there is a discount. Maybe this one's firm though. Never mind. I forgot it was firm. All right. Well, we have unloaded the cart. I delivered my little greyhound up front. I'm just gonna chill there while we continue to shop. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. In case you spotted something you just can't live without, we do post 25 to 30 new items in our eBay shop every single day and I've posted a link to that down in the description.